Hey little hoes, my name is Kristen and welcome back to my channel. So as you may know from my last video, the sunroom is a bit of a cluster right now. And it's very echoey in here because there are no plants. And the floor is ripped up and I will try and insert a little bit of footage here on just what it looks like at the moment. We had a pipe that ran underneath that needed to be fixed, so the floors had to be ripped up. But we're taking the opportunity to redo them, get some laminate flooring down instead of the heinous, with an emphasis on the anus, carpet that used to be in here. So yeah, that has been what's been going on in here. As you guys may know, all of my plants are now outside just because I didn't really have any space for them indoors in the living room. Well, the other day it was pouring down rain at 5 a.m. in the morning and absolute downpour. So I went out and put all of my poor little planties under the table. Some of them are pretty picky about the water situation, a lot of cacti and succulents, and I had literally just watered them before I moved them outdoors. So I didn't want to rot out any plants. So I moved them all under the table and my very sweet boyfriend, Casey, came out at 5 a.m. and in the rain and helped me move them all, which was very sweet. And then two hours later, the sun was out and shining and I guess I really didn't need to panic and move them all, but I did. We're just going to say just in case it rains again and I'm going to leave them there. But that's sort of a life update and I didn't need to buy plants, but a saw on Mercari, a very good price for a philodendron grazile g-r-a-z-i-e-l-a-e grazile grazile sounds like a grizzled old gazelle grazile but uh it was 25 bucks for a top cutting. Looks like it had two, possibly a third leaf starting. And these guys have been kind of pricey and I decided to just go ahead and get it. I needed a treat for myself. So I got a treat. It was a philodendron treat. So this is a little box. Um, it was, like I said, a little over $25 with tax, but the shipping was free, so I figured I couldn't really beat that. And I haven't found them for very cheap anywhere else. Um, I, I'm hoping it's doing alright, because it's been very, very hot here. Uncomfortably hot. I figured 25 bucks for a cut is pretty good. And the turnaround was really good with this seller. Um, if I'm happy with the product, I will try and list below the Mercari seller I ordered from. Pretty much the next day, they made the label and shipped out the next day. Came in good time. looks in very good shape they sent it in this is how i lose a finger sent it in plastic and damp moss and there are two layers in here with uh sort of a padding.
No bugs whatsoever. The moss is damp, but not wet. Oh, I kind of thought that was a root and was excited, but no, that's not no root. Exactly the root system I saw in the picture, but that sphagnum made it seem like it was extra chonky. So this guy, I'm not sure, I might just put it back in damp spag and sort of let it keep rooting out before potting it. It was a spontaneous buy. I'm happy with this and yeah, I shall call her Grizzled Grizzel. I love the little, like the very heart shaped foliage on this little baby. I have a feeling this is gonna be a really fast grower too. Anyway guys, that was just a quick little unboxing video and update. I am in the process of doing the sunroom makeover videos, so stay tuned for that. The next one is probably going to be sort of a compilation of the chaos in here and tearing up the floor, so stay tuned for that. I hope you are all doing well and staying safe, healthy, and sane. That's about it. I will talk to y'all later. A goodbye.